The sperm enters through the vaginal passage during sexual intercourse. It travels upward and reaches the oviduct where they may encounter egg. The fertilized egg, the zygote, gets implanted in the lining of the uterus and starts dividing. The uterus prepares itself every month to receive and nurture the growing embryo. The lining thickens and is richly supplied with the blood to nourish the growing embryo. The embryo gets nutrition from mother's blood with the help of a special tissue called placenta. Placenta is a disc which is embedded in the uterine wall. It contains villi on the embryo's side of the tissue. On the mother's side are the blood spaces which surrounds the villi. This provides larger surface area for glucose and oxygen to pass through mother to embryo. The developing embryo will also generate waste substances which can be removed by transferring them into mother's blood 